Welcome back to Angels Light to Row. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your weekly general message for August the 29th through September the 4th. Of course, we are going to start with career, move right into finances, and end with love. Angels, high vibrations for lovely, lovely Libra. Angels, what do the messages have for us? The angels' messages for us this week for lovely, lovely Libra. Thank you and thank you for for your career and for those of you who are yes 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 for those of you who are in a regular nine to five now let's let's see what's going on here so the major theme for your career this week is the queen of spades and the queen of hearts for you guys that are working a traditional job right so the queen of spades is telling me that you're going to have to go within this week because the queen of hearts is saying there's a lot of overtime for you there's a lot of work that you need to do that you typically you don't really want to do so there's something there's a switch that's inside of you that says okay libra it's time to work it's time to put in the work less time at home more time at work okay now when we look at and even if you are home maybe you're working from home i feel like it's less less interaction with the home and more interaction with yeah your office space now when we look at the recent past when it came to your career two of hearts two of diamonds i feel like in the recent past there was um I'm picking up maybe there was someone in your uh, career in your business in your workplace where you work there was it feels like a very I'm gonna say a companion that you really liked at your position but that was in the past okay you know I hear you like to, you're like Dora what about that companion what about that companion in the past all right let's clarify that companion in the past I feel like that goes there let's clarify that companion I'm just feeling like you need it all right with the eight of hearts I feel like someone may have had a maybe someone you worked with maybe there was a bit of um, flirtation if you will and I'm gonna leave that there and you know exactly what I'm talking about Libra now when we look when we look in the middle of the week we have the five of spades and the ace of clubs there is something that you will be learning this week in reference to your position I feel like whatever this is that you are learning it is going to change your environment for some of you you may be moving so for some of you you may be changing what you are doing within your job that you already are doing for some of you you may even even be thinking about changing your profession or your job now when we look at the end of the week we have the two of clubs and the seven of diamonds so I definitely see that you guys are talking about mm, I, I need I need a promotion I need more money this isn't enough that's at the end of the week now with the seven of diamonds remember with the seven of diamonds this is a faith card have faith that it will come and guess what yes it will come and more than you expected okay now your bonus is is right on point here remember we talked about having faith here well your bonus is always a positive eight of diamonds eight of diamonds two of diamonds so expect that advancement um, that financial advancement coming not necessarily a promotion but more money or more responsibility but more responsibility is actually coming with that money now when we look at you guys who are entrepreneurs, I feel like you guys are working over time. Work, 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 work. You're doing the inner work because I feel like you're shifting. You're wanting to do something different. You're wanting something different. Therefore, you have to change something with inside of yourself to make that happen. Will you be working? Will you be burning the midnight hour? Absolutely, you will. But you know, in order to create this change, you have to change within yourself. In the recent past, Libra, when we have the eight of hearts, two of hearts, yeah. I feel like in the recent past, you guys worked with someone, yes, that was, um, you know, I kind of feel like there was someone in your recent past that you, you worked with them, you liked them, but I don't feel like it was the best energy for you, no. We're going to leave that there, okay? That was in the past anyway. Now, in the middle of the week, ace of clubs, five of spades, you are definitely digging deep in the brain, in the noggin here, because you want some changes within your career. You want something new, and you're trying to figure out, how do I do this? 
How, how, how? With end of the week with the two of clubs and the seven of diamonds, I see you having a lot of conversations with people on how to increase your bottom line. You might even be doing research on the internet. How do I increase this? What do I need to do? Sometimes you don't need to do anything. You just need to let your angels work. Yeah, have faith. Let your angels work on your behalf behind the scenes. Now, if you do that, if you do that, Libra, as the bonus said for the nine of fivers, yeah, there's going to be abundance. Everything that you need will be there for you. So congratulations on your jobs and career, Libra. Now, let's go ahead and move into your finances for the week. Angels, we want high vibrations. Thank you and thank you. This does not go here. Thank you. All right, so Libra, finances this week. I feel like with the seven of diamonds, there is a little bit of fear when it comes to your resources, but practice faith. The seven of diamonds guarantees that if you walk in faith, that more money than you actually need or want will actually show up for you. When we look in the recent past with the two of diamonds, I feel like you committed yourself to some type of financial institution um, or some, some type of financial you aligned yourself with something. It could have been a retirement. It could have been um, a 401k or things of that nature. Or maybe it was just a new job. I feel like we need a clarifier on this finances here. Hmm. What was this? What was this that you committed yourself to? Ah, it, you committed yourself to leveling up financially. It was enough. It was definitely enough that you connected with, but you also had to be mindful of overspending here. Now, in the middle of the week with the Ten of Diamonds, finances will fall into your lap. You will feel that you are protected on all sides with this wonderful Jupiter influence of abundance. So yeah, no money worries in the middle of the week. But remember, let go of the fear. Let go of the fear. Get out of that consciousness, okay? Okay, now, by the end of the week with the Jack of Diamonds, I feel that you will be, for some of you, you will be doing something creative when it comes to your finances. For some of you, you may be having fun, spending on you, enjoying life at its finest. Your bonus here with the Four of Diamonds, even though you're enjoying your yourself at its finest, your bonus is saying that you're still a oh. Okay, so if you need to go out and, and with this with this wonderful luck of uh, resources coming your way, if you want to go out and, and get a massage or get your hair cut or, or buy some new shoes, whatever it is, I see that in the forecast for you, okay? All right, let's move on to love. For lovely, lovely Libra. We're looking for love here. What is going on? We're going to start with singles, and then we're, we're going to go back around again. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And look into those of you who are in a committed relationship. There we go. So major theme for the week when it comes to love, there is a lot of physical energy around you with the two of hearts, a lot of romance for you singles, okay? In the recent past, there may have been a new relationship coming. For some of you, this may have been in the recent past, someone um, starting family or maybe someone in the recent past got pregnant or something of that nature, but it is in the recent past. If it's not a new baby, then definitely it's a new relationship that you started in the past. In the middle of the week with the nine of hearts, you are either A, giving up on this love, this, this physical love you have, or you are giving more love to it. And you're like, I don't know if I'm going to be giving more love to it, Dora. By the end of the week, you definitely have player, player energy around you. You can literally do what it is that you want everyone everyone is attracted to you your bonus here this is a good thing is a sacrifice there's a sacrifice in love for you what is the sacrifice hmm what is the sacrifice uh, somebody wants to make a commitment with you uh, why is that a sacrifice I don't feel like you are ready for a commitment I feel like that is a sacrifice but here it is if someone is wanting to make a sacrifice with you and this is your bonus, then it's a good thing. Okay. All right. So let's take a peek. Let's go back around again for those of you who are in a beautiful bond. Okay. So you are focusing on love this week. You are focusing on your partnership, text messages, um, 
little love notes, things of that nature. You're focused on all of that with your partner. Everything feels very, I want to say, romantic with your partner. In the recent past, I feel like you guys had a new beginning. In the middle of the week, you are actually throwing a lot of love onto the situation. You are gaining their attention, trust me. Whatever it is that you're doing, you're doing it well. When the, we look at your bonus here with the four of hearts and the jack of hearts, there is someone is going to, I feel like all of this is going to make someone make a sacrifice and commit more to this relationship. Whether that's moving in, whether that is um, getting engaged, spending more time together, holidays, trips, marriage, renewals of marriage, things of that nature. You might not want to do it, but the sacrifice is a beautiful sacrifice, okay? So I'm going to leave that there. I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.